Today's lesson is about nouns, and especially common and proper nouns. So what are nouns? A noun is a word for a person, a place, or a thing. It is also known as a naming word. And here are a few types of nouns. Common nouns, proper nouns, abstract nouns, collective nouns, countable and non-countable nouns, as well as gender. Here are a few examples of nouns. Nouns given to people. For example, soldier, girl, doctor. They are all nouns. Animals, dog, goat, cow. For places, house, Cape Town, school. For things, table, car, ruler. And for ideas or feelings, kindness, joy, inspiration. inspiration. Let's have a look at common nouns. They are names given for a class of person, place or thing. They answer to the question, what is it? For example, what is it? It's a boy, a bridge, a cat, a tower. So boy, bridge, cat and tower are all common nouns. It can directly follow articles. And examples of articles are a or a and the or quantity words such as some, a lot, and 10. Nouns usually use an article, but not always. So you have to be careful there. Here is an example. The boy. The is an article, therefore boy is your noun. So let's identify the common nouns in the paragraph. A towel was put on the pillow for the cat to use as its bed. She dug her claws into it and fell asleep. Gary placed her food and water near the towel. Her favourite toys were there too. She liked to play with a little ball, a sock and a ball of wool. So let's see if you found those common nouns. In the first sentence, we have towel, pillow, cat, and bed. In the next sentence, we have claws. The following sentence, we have food, water, and towel. Followed by the word toys. And in the final sentence, we have ball, sock, and wool. Proper nouns. It is the given name of a person, a place, or a thing. It has its own name, and it answers the question, what is its name? And it also starts with a capital letter. Here are a few examples. Nelson Mandela is the name of our former president. His first name and surname therefore starts with a capital letter. Table Mountain is a name given to a mountain. Therefore, table and mountain both start with a capital letter. Shoprite is a name given to a chain of stores. Therefore, Shoprite is a proper noun and the S at the beginning of ShopRite has a capital letter. Whalia Crescent is a name given to a street or a crescent, therefore Whalia and Crescent starts with capital letters. 
and John is a name given to a person. It's so therefore a proper noun, and John therefore has starts with a capital letter. So let's list the common and proper nouns in the following paragraph. On a Sunday at 50 Rondo Street in Shelley Park, Vuyo cuts the grass with the lawnmower. The engine makes a roaring noise as he shows his son how to push it over the yard. After the lawn is cut, the boy uses a rake to rake up the clippings and put them into a big bag. Now I would like you to make two columns. The first column has a heading common nouns and the second column has the heading proper nouns. And I would like you now to find those common and proper nouns and put them under the appropriate heading. Let's see how you fared. There are our common nouns, grass, lawnmower, engine, noise, sun, yard, lawn, boy, clippings, and bag. And our proper nouns are Sunday, Rondo Street, Shelley Park, and Vuyo. Well done.